Hello YouTube. Uh, just a quick video, hopefully quick, uh, on what I do in my mixture for uh, hydroponic uh, lettuce uh, and then also my mixture for hydroponic tomatoes. Um, generally what I've gone off of, I've used the uh, formula from MHP Gardener and uh, he uh, has really done a, lot, done a lot of experimenting with this and I pretty much have uh, let him do a lot of the R&D because uh, sure it saves me a lot of time and what he's found really works for me too. Uh, what he's been using is the 41838 Master Blend um, fertilizer and he gets his, I think he gets his from Morgan County Feed and uh, I don't know if you can read that or not. Hopefully it's not dumping all over my uh, deal there. 41838 Fertilizer's Master Blend and uh, also, another part of this mixture formula is calcium nitrate, and then good old uh, Epsom salt. And yeah, I, I never do until lately that Epsom salt, uh, magnesium sulfate, is a fertilizer. Just makes sense, I guess. So, um, what do what do we do? Obviously, nitrogen keeps the plants healthy and green. Your uh, fertilizers just keep plants healthy and growing, uh, pretty much. Uh, what I've heard about Epsom salt, it gives the plants better taste. I'm not sure if I'm right on that, but uh, yeah, you know, I'm just gonna have faith and just trust that it works. Is it organic? I, you know, they're all chemicals. Uh, they're all chemicals. And uh, I'm not going to make claims that this is organic or I'm not going to get into a shouting match with anybody either. Oh, gosh, you should be using organic, blah, 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 this and that, whatnot. I just know this works for me. And so far, nobody's died from eating my tomatoes or lettuce and actually tastes just as well or better as ground grown uh, tomatoes or lettuce. Obviously, uh, in the house, they're a lot less buggy and stuff. Tomatoes, they grow in a greenhouse. But lettuce, I kind of like growing in the house. It, it does work pretty nice. But anyway, but uh, I'm not going to go into pouring it. It's just really not that big of a deal. But what I use is I use a scale that has uh, does grams. And uh, this will zero out if I hold the steer still enough. And then I uh, take and put my uh, little glass cup here, zero it out, tear, tear it out, or whatever you want to call it. So I'm zero. And then what I do is I use one gram on lettuce. I use one gram um, per uh, gallon of Epsom salt, uh, two grams of the calcium nitrate and two grams of the 41838 special tomato fertilizer master blend brand I think that's what it is and it, it, it seems to work really nice but uh, anyway it's going to be about the end of my video what I then I, what I do is I dump it all into a beaker here and I pour a little bit of water and mix it up then I take and you can see my um, totes back there and I'll get into that in a little bit here. But uh, this will pretty much be the end of my video. Uh, no use watching me, me pour in and spill all over the place fertilizer and stuff like that. It's kind of boring. So but that's what I use. I already have one mixed up. I tried a video and I failed quite badly at it. So, and it was like twice as long as what this one was. And it no sense. And getting into pouring something into a glass thing on a scale and watch it spill over the place. That's, that's boring. So thanks for watching. Uh, tomato, I use uh, 6 grams of Epsom salt and 12 of uh, the nat calcium nitrate and 12 of the uh, uh, Master Blend Fertilizer, the 41838. And what it amounts to is for lettuce, is for, this is per 5 gallons. And for lettuce, it's uh, it's the 5, 10, and 10. So, quick deal. And that's why I'm saying it's 1 gram per gallon, 2 grams.
per gallon. Otherwise, if you want to get really technical, it's 1.2. Uh, no, wait a minute. Yeah, 1.2 uh, for a tomato and 2.4 per gallon on the uh, on, on the rest of the two uh, deals here. But I'll shut up. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.